with Wesker. So you've come. Chris, you make me proud. But of course, you are one of my men. Thanks. Chris! Jill? Wesker! Thank you, Barry. Well, what do you know? Oh, don't blame Barry for everything. I hear that his better half and two lovely daughters will be in danger if he doesn't do everything I tell him to. You were behind all of this. Since when, Wesker? I'm afraid I don't know what you're talking about. Since when have they been slipping you a paycheck? I think you're a bit confused. I've always been with Umbrella. And stars were Umbrellas. No, rather, my little piggies. The Tyrant virus leaked, polluting this whole place. And unfortunately, I had to give up my lovely members of stars. So having stars nosing about is an inconvenience. You killed them with your own dirty hands. You son of a bitch. No. Oh, yes, dear. Just like this. Rebecca! Don't move. You. You bastard. I don't think you want to die just yet. I have something that's of some interest to you. Barry, go up on the ground and wait there. Barry. <laughs> you gotta love Barry. He must really be afraid of Umbrella. You and Umbrella took his family. You bastard. <coughs> oh, you son of a... <coughs> Umbrella. Well, I used some carrots and sticks to cow him. But it had nothing to do with Umbrella. The things you mentioned are nothing. I'll burn all of them along with this entire laboratory. What? What are you planning? I'm senile. Chris, you'll never understand. It's magnificent. Even if it meant my family, I couldn't bear turning my back on my friends again. <laughs> Rebecca! Chris. It's a good thing you were wearing your bulletproof vest. There's nothing left for us to do here. Let's get moving. Go on. I'll leave that up to you, Rebecca. I'm on it. I'll start the self-destruct system I found a little while ago. It's not like we're out of this yet. I'll see you on the outside. Outside. This is Brad. I'm running out of fuel. If there's anyone alive, contact me now. Just give me a sign. And I repeat, this is your last chance. Three minutes to detonation. Damn it! We're almost there! Jill, you just get in contact with Brad! No! We can make it.
Don't move. so I can see him. Get your hands up. Hurry up! Don't be stupid. Jill! <laughs> 